So the roles of the mental health care team are that the veterinarian needs to be making the diagnosis, prescribing, and prognosing. We need to stay within that realm. The veterinary nurse can be the eyes and the ears for the veterinarian. Uh, along with the trainer. So for instance, in my situation, I actually go out and go to people's homes, take video, write an assessment, and then that goes to the general practitioner. So basically, they're going with me. They're seeing what I'm seeing. Uh, the role of the, the trainer is if we don't have a veterinary nurse that has that background, they're going to be helping the pet parent apply the behavior modification and training techniques that have been prescribed. Then the, the uh, referral service is going to be there again for when it's something that's going to need uh, much maybe a different type of medication plan something that is kind of out of our realm the veterinary social worker would be there then if let's say for instance um, I have a case where I know the, animal, the, the pet parent is really struggling. This is going to be a difficult time. As a veterinary technician specialist, I help them with that. I can guide them with that, but sometimes you need more. And so that's what I, I'm, we're looking at when once we have veterinary social workers, that's going to be a wonderful thing.